Since its beginnings four years ago, Vivarium in Utrecht has become one of the most important trade fairs for aquaristics and terroristics in the Netherlands, drawing hobby aquarium and terrarium keepers from all over Europe. The VIPs of the European scene flock to Utrecht every year in order to present themselves and to discuss all kinds of things with the visitors. The overall atmosphere during Vivarium is absolutely unique. No other event throughout Europe compares to it. Vivarium is not only a trade fair but a mixture of hobby market, events and booths where manufacturers and dealers present what's new on an area of 10,000 square meters. The booths and tanks at Vivarium are always specially decorated. This is one of its great strengths. Sometimes booths and aquariums look rather traditional, although still very beautiful and diligently set up. But like e.g. these tanks and the booth of the Crayfish and Shrimp Forum and Shop. The probably most unconventional and spectacular aquarium of the entire fair might be the one right next to the restaurant. A Ford car with some very special drivers. Another unconventional highlight is the piano that was made into an aquarium. The basic theme of aquarium and design underlies west parts of the exhibition. For example, there is a TV set that does not show the same old reruns, whose setup still reminds of the Jungle Camp though. TV criticism, but different. These playful variations of aquaristics make Vivarium outstanding, unique and give it special charm. Originally, Vivarium was a hobby market and a pastime project of Marco Orcas, the organizer. This spirit can still be felt even in the fourth year of this get-together. Besides various dealers who offer their most recent products and decoration materials, there are the animal markets that draw the most visitors. A regular guest at Vivarium is book author and aquatic plants expert Crystal Kasselmann. Her book, Aquarienpflanzen, is the standard work for aquarium plants. Its third edition was issued 2010. This event is one of her personal highlights every year. Consistent with the trendy topic of aquatic plants, a photo contest focusing on plant tanks was held in the run-up to Vivarium. This year's winners are from Forum Miroshaki. The tank setup, based on the Amano style, mostly convinced the jurors due to its clear concept that requires only a few stylistic elements. Setting up a complete tank in only an hour, this very special contest demands a lot of its participants. There is not a lot of material to decorate an entire underwater world at hand which means they have to plan a design, translate it to the tank and present it in the end in a way that convinces the jury in just one hour. This year's masterwork, a mini Stonehenge, underwater. The true masters of planter tanks are the aquascapers of the UCAPS, the UK Aquatic Plant Society. Besides displaying their fantastically set-up tanks, they also hold workshops. Another reason why Vivarium is so popular. Those interested can learn a lot from the pros, who love the contact with the audience and are very generous with advice for the perfect planted tank. Motivated by the great success, the organizers promised to exceed themselves in 2011 and they are more than content with this year's outcome. In 2011 this exhibition will be held on March 26 and 27 in Utrecht as always.